How's it going gamers? Welcome to video. So today we're talking about a brand new Demon Slayer game that's coming out apparently in June 20, in June 20, 2023. Now, so I've looked at this game a little bit. I've kind of searched some stuff up. There is like nothing on this game. Just straight up. There is like nothing at all. I don't think this is real, but we're going to look at it and I'm going to get some people's opinions in the comments. If anything does pop up that's like brand new that I didn't talk about, do let me know in the comments. Anyone will be able to see what's going on? Maybe it's real, maybe it's fake. I'm leaning towards real, but then fake at the same time. I'm not sure. But anyway, going over this, we have a video here. We're going to watch this. I'm going to turn off the audio because there is copyright music, so I can't have it on, which actually brings up a good point that I'll talk about a bit later. So, new Demon Slayer game. As you can see, we have some of the characters shown, looks normal at the moment to be honest oh my god jesus christ what the okay i was just looking at nezuko there all right all right uh yeah so <laughs> as you can see we have the characters here this seems like this like the archive from some of the images i've seen already of the game which is pretty interesting i guess these are all the ssr characters we have stuff from the anime which is showed as well this isn't like related to game. so that's something to take into account but here is actual gameplay now so this is probably the most interesting part from what i've seen this is kind of similar to most games i will go back here a little bit and just go back a little bit more so this is in 480p so the quality is going to be garbage i don't know why they uploaded this like this either the channel's fake which it could be but i'm not sure it's just called rage of demon king and no description the channel has no description so I'm not really sure, but when you look at this, you can see there's 1x, which basically probably means the speed of it. There's skip. There's GM, which I think means the actual name of the player. From what I understand, there is actually, in terms of gameplay, I believe it's 4 versus 4. As you can see, some of the characters have like buffs. Rengoku either has me. I think he's got an attack down like that. Just this is very difficult. And from the looks of things, each team takes a turn. That's like the turn order, basically. That's kind of what I get from it. But if we just keep going, you will see Rengoku uses ultimate. Looks pretty cool, I guess. As you can see, he. To be fair, right? If it's real, like this part here as well, it looks pretty decent. Nothing too crazy. Obviously, here you can actually look at the characters. You can move them around. One thing I've also realized is like you have like skills here and you have stats. Oh, why I'm really confused is because the game has like four stats and that's everything. It might be like a bigger button to be able to see more things, but I, I don't believe it for some reason. I just kind of but skills are quite interesting because there it looks like there's five different skills. I mean, fair enough, I guess. You'd have to really play it to really get a good understanding of what it is, but... I'm just a little bit, I've just been holding back a little bit, but it looks legit in some way. Anyway, like if this is real, it's pretty decent, I guess. Yeah, okay, if we just keep going here, obviously more characters, etc. And this is the part where I become a little bit more confused. I don't know if this is real, right? I don't know if this part's real. To be fair, I take like a bigger look at it now. And if these are the actual ornaments in the game, they look pretty decent in general. It looks like they use very much the same thing from uh, Hinokami Chronicles, which is obviously a Demon Slayer game. I don't know if they use the same models or something like that, but very, very similar. To be fair, the anime kind of has the same look in ultimate. So I guess that's pretty much fair. But yeah, quite interesting. I'm not sure. I originally thought, to be honest, this was from Hinokami Chronicles, but I, I don't know if it is. I'm not sure. Yeah, and then the end of the trailer. Pretty much almost there. Uh, shows a couple of the characters. No scares in it too. Looks pretty decent to be fair. The actual art in itself. And yeah, that is that is the game. What do I think? I don't know if I believe it. Just doesn't make sense. Either the people who were like actually releasing this game have got like the worst marketing ever for like global. Or maybe this is like a decent JP game that like people played in Asia. 
and it's only coming out now because I've seen quite a bit of weird translations. I'll actually go through that in a second. As you can see here, this is the part where it doesn't really make sense to me. This, the, I'm, listen, I'm getting deep into this, I'm sorry. As you can see here, with the writing at the bottom, it's so weird because they have so many like different fonts. They have so many different writing. It confuses me. I don't know what they did here. Did they go over it? I'm not sure. But anyway, moving on to more of the actual things I found. So I was actually on a Reddit post before, as we can see here. And I was curious if this game's real because my friend believes it. But to be honest, I'm just a very skeptical person. It doesn't really make sense with what I've seen. I also can't find this in the app store, so pay that into account. But yeah, so is Rage of Demon King a legit Demon Slayer game? Now, funnily enough, the, the comments are just no. No, it's not legit. I don't know if that's true. I'm presuming it's not real as well. And this just, just says, just by looking at it, you can tell cash grab, a trash cash grab low budget game. Yeah, it doesn't look great. It, it doesn't look great. I'm going to be honest. Some people might actually like how it looks. Like, let's say Hypothetical is a real game. I don't like how it looks. I feel like this specific screen. And this actually moves me on to the next thing I found. Tap Tap is like the only place I've been able to find anything really about it. As you can see here, we have a great comment just straight away. Where I'm just going to point out. It's Demon Slayer and it's amazing. Nice. But if we look at some of the pictures, this is like the promotional art. I'll actually try and zoom in here. Not... Amazing quality, but as you can see, pretty cool, I guess. I actually found it quite funny that they had um, Muzan in his, like, actual form, I guess. Very, I, I think that's Muzan. I might be completely wrong. I've not got to that part or anything, but I a bit weird that they kind of put him here. And also the description of the game is something similar to being about him, I think. So I don't really understand that. But if we just go through here, as you can see... This is kind of a gameplay when they actually show it. This does not look very good. It doesn't look very good, I'm gonna be honest. I don't believe it really. Um, the translations are a bit mixed. I don't wanna like talk about translations because, you know, someone might have just done it wrong. But as you can see here, are you looking for the true power to protect the weak? Okay, makes sense. The next one is, I won't not stop until annihilate all demons. So, a bit of a translation uh, problem there. And then we have here, don't ever give up, don't try to take the easy way out. And I think this last one is the real one. I was like, wait a minute, what? What's going on? But blows maybe, no matter how devastating. Listen, I say that all the time. I say that all the time. But anyway, this is everything that's pretty much about the game. I mean, there's more gameplay here, but I don't really feel like this is worth going through. I don't really know what to think of it. When I look at a screen like this, it looks like a very game. Um, I'm just gonna say it. it, it like, like the person said, it's probably, probably just a trash cash grab, but then again, never know. I mean, we'll have to see. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please drop us a like. If you want to see more content like this, I do Arc Knight stuff mostly now, because I enjoy it. So if you want to see more stuff like that, Please drop us a like and I will see you in the next one. Hopefully this game is good and real. That's my hope. I actually don't think it's any of them. So it's great.